All right, Mac, you tell him. Steve Mack, a former TCW heavyweight champion, holding that title for one year, one week at one time. And don't forget, he's currently uh, one third of the TCW Tag Team Champions, along with uh, the Church's Money, Black G's, and the Joker. The Demon Saints, the Tri-State Saints, whatever you want to call them, they are the champions. He didn't bring the gold out here tonight, so he's in the ring. But right there, you see that repeat defender shirt, and in fact, the shorts he's wearing and the boots he's wearing, he pulled those out of his personal collection. Steve Mossimak hasn't worn those boots or those shorts since he teamed with Danny Moff back in 2017. He told me that himself earlier, and I wanted to make sure I put that over on commentary. He pulled out the special uh, e equipment for a match that I think he really admires and respects PJ, but he certainly isn't trying to be the stepping stone. He's not trying to be the one that, yo brother, you're the next generation. Steve Monster Max still has got a lot of gas in the tank, and he wants to prove that he can hang with a young upstart. The quality and the aggressiveness is PJ Savage. That's it, PJ says. He's got the hit squad Mac, like I said, them shorts, them boots, mean a lot to him. He put those away five years ago, but he pulled them out tonight because he wants to bring out the best in PJ, and he's hoping PJ brings out the best in him. Yes, we know your name, PJ. Stop you. You don't have to keep yelling your name. Oh, PJ wants me to remind people he represents only Savage. He is all about getting himself to the next level on his own accolades and his own credentials. And going through a guy like Steve Monster, Mac, if you can pick up a win here tonight, that's When's the last time you can recall seeing Monster Mac get dropped down by a shoulder ta tackle takedown? Wow. That's a huge statement. Savage knocking down the guy. Y'all gonna be sorry about this. Is definitely one of those main events. Sometimes it's not about your main event match being for a title. We just saw a remarkable match with Johnny Moran and Anthony Gangone. But we put this match here to remind people that we got a deep locker room and it's not just about title matches, it's about aggressiveness and it's about quality main events, title or no title. Can we get the child out of the ring? Psych out there by <laughs> Not tonight, boys. Let's save that for WrestleMania. Oh wait, that already happened. A ten-year-old won a tag team. Oh my God! Two hundred seventy pounds in death. I can do better. Toasty man. Two big men that move around like cruiserweights. And this is what Furious Intentions is all about. He's calling out that twerp, that kid. He's like, you want a piece of me now? I guarantee you that kid would not be a repeat offender. He'd be one and done. Forget about it. Bing, bada, I'm telling you. <laughs> well, in a very successful tag team now, like you said, with with Joker and with Black G's, the Tri-State Saints, the Demon Saints have you. Holding gold everywhere on the globe with Danny Moff as the hit squad and a very accomplished singles competitor, as you can see right here. 
Wow. After that lariat, I'd be flexing too. That was pretty impressive. That's rattled PJ. We don't see PJ get rattled by a lariat too often. Uh, yeah. And that's what Max says. Mac has got PJ right where he wants him. Cut him right off. This is a good idea. You need to space yourself. Oh, wait a minute. He sets up the veteran. Every hit is a game changer in a match like this. PJ. That was a good one. That was pretty good. But now I think he's going to get a savage size chop. Oh, oh! Man, oh man, give that fan a contract with that Yankees hat. Man, oh man. Aaron, Aaron Judge needs that guy to help him hit 62. But if you ask these athletes, can your adrenaline really pump too much? This is what these guys live in will eventually die for if you ask them. Any true professional wrestler will tell you that they are willing to give it all for this business. And these two gentlemen, the young upstart and the wily veteran, giving it their all. 20 plus years experience for Steve Mastamac and PJ Savage entering just his first couple of years in the industry, a relative baby still to pro wrestling, but certainly has had a lot of veteran savvy matches under his belt in a short period of time. Savage said that all you got you? Be smart, PJ, be smart, bro. Yeah. Savage is the opposite. He wants smart. four. You see? He want, yes, sir, man. Have another. And Monster Mac more than willing to serve him up another slice. The brains right now. Come on, bro. PJ Savage believes he's not going to get to where he wants to be if he, if he goes back or backs down. You gotta step up to the biggest, baddest man in the yard sometimes to get that respect and ultimately earn a contract somewhere. <laughs> wow! It's called Steve Monster Mac. He hit hard. I mean, that's Mike Tyson spinal type of hit right there. Holy crap. Man, oh man. Monster Mac did, didn't just bump back on his back. His skull hit the canvas. He got hit full force. I mean, PJ gave his body on the line, but I think Mac got a little bit worse to wear on that exchange for Savage chance. Right hand from Mac. Savage returns the favor. This is what the main event is all about. TCW, Furious Intentions, HCW Network Productions, Malphi TV. This is wrestling. Oh my god, that one connected. Here you go. Failure to defend it, and uh, the uh, 
Tri-State Saints have you went on to win the uh, vacated titles. These two have been on a collision course for months, and it culminates here tonight at Furious Intentions. It's going to fall down. This is about Demon Saints. This is out about Takeover, man. This is about oh. Savage versus Matt. And Max straight the eyes? I didn't see that. He, by any means necessary, Steve Max has been praising that to me forever. Whatever it takes. Savage trying to get a suplex on the big man. He's looking for it. Come on, Savage! Ah! Savage, cover up kick! Tuesday fatality! Win it here! You gotta be impressed by that, gentlemen. Impressed? Beyond! A Herculean effort here in Brick! Savage, you gotta stay on him, though. He's got him in his sights, but that took a lot out of Savage, too. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, man. He might be looking for that running knee. What's he thinking here? He's got to figure it out. Pop the clutch. Full blown sports car style. You know what it is. Savage knee by the Savage one of Savage Jimmy. But unfortunate break right there as Steve Moss and Max momentum to the outside where PJ can't win the match by a pink or submission. I mean, yeah. picking up a countout victory just wouldn't be the same in the main event. You want to get that pinfall or that submission. Pinfall right here for the win. Wow. What? Man, Pat Savino doing his best Aubrey Edwards impersonation with that two count right there. Frozen in time. That was two. Man, oh man, it doesn't get much closer than that, gentlemen. Back in a battle, I haven't seen that. Yeah. And this sort of stayed a long time. But PJ can't slow it down. Full gas, no brakes. That's the motto around here. Uh, but you, you leave that opening and look at Monster Mac, the Wiley veteran. It's not that easy, PJ. Wow. Wow. Credit to PJ for hitting such a highly effective move, but credit to Monster Mac for somehow picking out. Wow. Not that easy. <laughs> But Savage trying to give him everything and all that he's got left. He said it's my time, but no one told him. He got left. Wait, 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 wait. No, he rolled through. No. He got him. He got him. Here we go, winner. Awesome. Hey, kid. Hey, kid. Kid. 
day wasn't your day. Honestly, that was awesome. But you know what else? You're never going to beat me. No. This is going to leave a sour taste in my mouth. But I want to let each and every one of you know one thing. This, my journey, it starts right now. It starts at this time. And this journey is going to end with two things happening. Me beating Monster Mac in the middle of this ring. Whether it's a dog collar match, a ladder match, or a cage match. Mac, I ain't going to put you to sleep. But my goal, my main goal at Titan Championship Wrestling, why I'm here for each and every one of you, is one reason, and one reason only, and that is the Titan Championship Wrestling Heavyweight Championship. Another man with his sight set. High goals on that Titan Championship Wrestling Heavyweight title. You see, brother, you look at where I started. And it will be described by one word. Thank you so much for watching HW Network Productions and Mob Fight TV. Period.